Hey all, welcome to Share Trek. This is Raj here. Friends, how are you today? I hope you are fine. And uh, before I start today's segment, I just want to tell you that there are so many things to be grateful about in life. We should be a glass half full person, not a glass half empty. There are so many things that have been done for treating HIV. And today, I want to once again look at Gilead Sciences. I had reviewed this company for our genomic investors and thought that there was a very, very strong emphasis on HIV. And so it warrants a separate video for our HIV viewers. I had already made part one where I have covered the first six HIV medications from Gilead out of the 12 that they have, uh, which are uh, FDA approved. And you can find a link in the description below in case you have not seen it. Or you can go to the homepage of our YouTube channel and search for Gilead and you will find them there. Uh, that said, however, before we proceed, please smash the subscribe button, uh, the like button, and the notify button to help our channel grow. We are very close to 5,000, and your subscription may push us to 5,000. And uh, that will be amazing. Uh, we can then really have great guests from the industry and much more interesting programming and better sets. We also have the super thanks feature through which you can support the channel for HIV content until we touch 5,000. Uh, I have not yet uh, turned on the membership feature uh, because I want us to reach 5,000 before I do that. I want to work hard to reach 5,000 and then turn on the membership feature because then we'll have critical mass and we'll be able to do a lot more things uh, when we get monetized. That said, let's get started. <music> Welcome back, friends. Remember in the last uh, video, I mentioned that uh, uh, just like you buy fruits by the dozen, Gilead Sciences has a dozen HIV medications. This shows the depth of investment Gilead has made to tackle HIV problems. And uh, in the last video, we spoke of Bictarvi, uh, Complera, I think uh, Descovi, uh, Amtriva, uh, Genvoya and I think ODFC. These were the six medicines that we spoke about. And uh, here is a list of the remaining six medication and their properties. Please note that not all of these are available outside of US. So my uh, video has been made looking at what they have for offer within US. Uh, outside US, many of these things may not be available. So I'm going to start with number seven, which is uh, Stribbled. S-T-R-I-B-I-L-D. Stribbled is a, a prescription a medicine and it's indicated as a complete regimen for the treatment of HIV-1 infection in adults and pediatric patients weighing at least 35 kilos who have no antiretroviral treatment history or to replace a current ARV uh, regimen uh, in those who are virologically suppressed uh, on a on a stable ARV regimen for at least six months and have a HIV RNA less than 50 copies per ml uh, with no history of treatment failure and no known substitutions associated with resistance to individual components of uh, Stribbled. So that's the technical definition they have on their website. Uh, however, when you go to your uh, doctor, the doctor will be able to tell you whether you're eligible for Stribbled and how you should be taking it. Costs uh, of this particular medicine is, um, is around uh, 4,202 for 30 tablets in the US. Dosage is directed by physician and typically is once a day. And um, uh, that uh, tops off number seven. At number eight, we have Sunlenka. I remember I have already made a special video on Sunlenka earlier, and I'll uh, put a link to that in the description. Uh, if you want to check it out, you can always do that, or else you can go to our homepage and uh, type Sunlenka in the search bar, and you will find uh, my video on Sunlenka, which is also known as uh, Lenacapivir. Uh, it's an injection which is a combination, uh, which is in combination with other antiretrovirals, is indicated for the treatment of HIV-1. And uh, it's uh, heavily, uh, it's for heavily uh, treatment experienced adults with uh, multi drug resistant HIV uh, infection, uh, failing their current antiretroviral regimen uh, due to resistance, intolerance, or safety considerations. The cost of Sunlenka oral tablet is around 3,431 for a supply of four tablets. And the dosage varies depending on whether it is in injection form or oral tablets. The first option in their website says that you have to take two 1.5 ml injections along with 2 into 300 mg tablets followed later on by uh, 
600 mg tablets on day two. So the cost of 3 ml is currently around 20,543 US dollars. And with some uh, copay uh, based on insurance, the 3 ml injection, those two injections could cost you as low as 9,600 per year. So that's the information I have. Uh, details may vary because I am taking information from uh, the internet. So if you have a doctor, you talk to the doctor and they will be able to uh, give you prescriptions and then you can find out from your insurance company as well as your pharmacist what is the best way to get it and uh, what is the cheapest way to get it. The next uh, uh, therapy that we have is uh, Truvada. Uh, Truvada is a prescription medi medicine and Truvada is um, uh, indicated in combination with other antiretroviral agents for the treatment of HIV-1 infection in adults and uh, it's also used in pediatric, uh, pediatric patients uh, as long as they weigh at least 17 kilos. The original Truvada which is uh, coming from uh, Gilead uh, costs around $2,000 per month without insurance and there is a generic version as well which costs somewhere between $30 and $60 per month. The next uh, uh, medicine that they, Gilead has is Tybost, T-Y-B-O-S-T. Tybost is a prescription medicine used in combination with other antiretroviral medicines to treat human Im immunodeficiency virus or HIV-1 infection in adults and in pediatric patients, weighing at least um, 35 kilos. So that's the criterion for pediatric patients. They should weigh at least 35 kilos and it's uh, co-administered with uh, some other medication uh, and um, yeah, they should... Uh, uh, co contact their doctor because there are various criterion based on which uh, they uh, co-administer with uh, different components uh, and I think the criterion is basically weight if you're around 35 kilos about uh, at least 35 kilos in weight then uh, it is co-administered with uh, uh, atazanavir uh, which is another uh, medication uh, and if you are weighing at least 40 kgs then it's co-administered with uh, darunavir so these are uh, two different um, uh, combinations that are available again uh, uh, your doctor is the best person to prescribe this for you uh, if it is suitable for you and uh, they will be able to give you guidance and the idea of presenting this here is just to make sure that most of the people who watch these videos I see many times in the comments people getting desperate that uh, when will the cure come it has been 20 years and it's been so long and all that I just want to highlight what a big struggle it is to make uh, uh, HIV therapy and we already have so many medicines which are available as ART. The only problem is you have to take it uh, one per day. But you can also look at it as an opportunity that you take uh, an ART combination a day and uh, you lead a normal life. So that's how I'd like you to look at it. And that's why I'm talking about all these medicines. Uh, typically, uh, this particular uh, medicine that is uh, uh, Tybost is uh, taken uh, as... Um, a tablet uh, at, it's almost a one tablet a day norm and it costs around 308 dollars for uh, 30 capsules so it's not that expensive but the other things that you're going to take with it might be costing more i have seen that in general everything hovers around four thousand dollars per month uh, that's what it looks like without insurance and with insurance probably it will be much less the next uh, uh, medicine that uh, gilead has is uh, viriad V-I-R-E-A-D. I pronounce it as Viriad. I don't know if that's the correct pronunciation. Uh, Viriad is a reverse uh, transcriptase inhibitor and is uh, indicated in combination with other antiretroviral agents for the treatment of HIV-1 infection in patients who are at least uh, two years of age and older and they should weigh at least 10 kilos. Viriad is also indicative for the treatment of uh, chronic he hepatitis B virus uh, in patients two years of age and older weighing at least 10 kilos, uh, costing around $1,300 for 30 tablets with a typical dosage of uh, tablet per day in combination with other drugs. The generic version is um, slightly less expensive at $1,200, so not much difference out there. And the last uh, medicine that they had was uh, Atripla, A-T-R-I-P-L-A. And I'm saying they had uh, because it was a single tablet treatment, but uh, Gilead has uh, uh, come up with more advanced medication since then. You have seen the 11 medicines that I spoke about. So Gilead no longer man manufactures uh, Atripla due to commercial reason and they have withdrawn it from the market. So that's my understanding. So friends, uh, this is where I would like to stop the video today. We have now seen all the 12 HIV medicines uh, Gilead has produced for HIV. 
And the reason I'm making this video is to demonstrate that if a single pharma company like Gilead has developed 12 distinct uh, options for treatment of HIV, you should be motivated by the fact that there are so many other companies working on HIV therapies and providing alternatives. Uh, then we have EBT-101, AGT-103, which are the next level of therapies in the making and which should become available in the very near future. So all in all, uh, it looks like a promising uh, uh, turning inflection point or turning point where things are only going to get better. In the next video, we'll take a look at the HIV therapy pipeline of Gilead and friends. They have 14 candidates, including Lenacapavir that is already in use for HIV prep as well as for treatment. So those are two separate entries in their pipeline out of the 14. So ex excluding these two, we still have uh, 12 uh, candidates in their pipeline for HIV. And uh, we're going to review them in the next video. After that, we will review each of the 12 approved HIV therapies in separate videos. One video for each of them, where I would explain how they actually work within the body. And um, uh, this will not interrupt our regular HIV updates because as and when anything new comes up in the HIV field, I'll prioritize that and bring the video to you. And when I don't have any new information, I'll start making these for so that you can be updated. And this will also allow me to give you a higher frequency of HIV programming, uh, especially for those who are in the Patreon and member section of the Indian channel. So if you are interested in this type of content, please subscribe and join our Patreon. It will help the channel keep up the pace of producing HIV-related programming. Uh, thanks for watching. And I also have a special thanks to our two Patreons uh, who have been uh, supporting this channel for a while, Jason and Howard. Uh, I can't be uh, more grateful to you. And I'm hoping that more of uh, our uh, viewers join the Patreon and uh, start supporting the channel. That's all for now. Thanks and have a great day. Bye for now.